words on burying parents. You now belong to a club called the natural order of things. It is little comfort, and though not raw forever, the wound will never heal. Do not run from your grief. Do not try to put your grieving behind you. Grief is a lasting testimony to worth. Lament is a holy part of life. Lament is a love song. Perhaps one day, all love songs won't end in laments. Before she departs, tell your mother it is okay for her to go. Speak the words aloud to her beautiful, suffering vessel. Release your hold and feel the universe expand by one. At the funeral, when your father's wavering grip surprises you, accept and cling to his unfamiliar hand. This is the lesson in vulnerability that you have never learned. Know that when it comes time, you will be ready to let him go. When it comes time, you are not ready to let him go. So you cry. You cry until you can't inhale. You cry until you choke on desperation. You cry until you clutch for the silence left behind you on the cliff from which you cannot stop falling. See now, a world hidden to dry eyes. You confront a neverness that is so absolute it consumes your every instance, rendering even your most unblemished memories soggy. Never again to be here with us, never again to embrace, never to share a meal with us. Questions you have will never be answered. Never again will she apprehend the world quietly. Never again will his fingers nurse geraniums from the earth. No, you will bury yourself on that day. You will be lowered by gardeners on squeaking straps into that ominous dry hole, curious neighbors looking on, everything stilled, only wind rustling oaks. It will be you over whom they slide that great slab with a heaviness ready to combust. It will be you unto whom they shovel dirt. It will be you who is left behind after wiping eyes and reading psalms. You now have one more thing in common with your siblings. The biggest thing you had in common with your siblings is now gone. So you visit the grave because pinks will ripen into purples and yellows will rot to brown. Orange will sing hallelujah. Fruit bruise blue on the ground. You will recognize all the things you knew before and remember delighting in them. Mown lawns will always remind you of father and mother's day will always hurt. You will delight in the things you knew before, but without a certain zest, passion, will be ever sobered by the somber everness of loss. The wind in the oaks abides, always bring flowers. <laughs>